Okay, I saw somebody go to Poros and make some money. So we're gonna do that. In a video, I saw somebody go to Poros and make some money now. Our speed should be good enough to avoid these people. So, um, I'm going to do what I saw in the video here. Okay, it's just going to keep reminding me of what I need to do. Okay, first let's go to trade. Okay, let's, um, oh, if we go to civilian, I saw somebody sell the civilian stuff. Oh, this body armor 10. This body armor, 12. All right. Let's see how many. That leaves us with 191. Done. Leave. Inventory. Slaughter. Uh, shift. Slaughter. Did more. Capacity exceeded, but we're not moving anywhere. Trade. And the hides. So we double our money there. And while we're at it, let's buy the sheep. I still get 1470 in all the sheep. Leave. Inventory. Hold. Control to do all. Shift to do five. I'm doing control. Okay, back in. Trade. Sell the hides. Sell the meat. Get a little bit. All right, now let's go to the tavern district as the tutorial is advising me and it's highlighting. I right clicked to look at him. There, he's cruel and impulsive, so I'm not interested in that. Okay, so now we got our inventory. We got 3,070 gold. We need some troops. I'd like to participate. I'll do that. Oh, I got a sword, okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, we'll take a few recruits. Um, a little 42, a little expensive, I think. What do you say we buy sheep and sell them in the city slaughtered? 516. Okay, now in the inventory. Control. the meat, all the hides, for a good profit, I'm going to buy one or I'm going to buy fish, they're a little cheaper, and they'll increase my variety. I'll take some Imperial recruits here. All right, I have eight troops against six mountain bandits. Save the game. Attack. Under my command. Okay. Let me see if I can distract them and then I'll send my troops after them. I'm pretty sure they have bows. Usually the mountain bandits do. There they are. Now say zero Soldier, F1 F3 down. for my people to attack. Yep, I didn't want to open myself up, so I just ran them with the horse. See, most of them are after me. So my troops largely outnumber them. So simply by distracting them and keeping the numbers against my troops down, we win. And I lost my Notice the length is smaller, so I'm not going to take it because on a, on a horse, I prefer a longer sword. That's an improvement. Now we can upgrade, but I'm not going, I'm going to upgrade one to an infantry and one to an archer. 
my cost is going to be 18 now. So I'm intentionally not upgrading some of them to keep my costs low here at the beginning. Now grain is 12 here. That's a better price. So I'll take a little bit of that. Got 1,048, so I can sell some of what I have here. Okay, and we'll get up to 10 here at the beginning. Nine troops with me. Notice I have made 2,000 dinars. I'm half of what I need for party, and I need to work on renown and get a companion. All right. Let's buy a hog and a sheep. 143. Now let's go to the city. All the hogs, the sheep, and the cow. Another 477. Now we go to the city. Is in the inventory the hogs, the sheep, and the cow. We'll sell all the hides. We'll sell all the meat. I'm not sure I made much for profit there, to be honest. Uh, let's ransom the prisoners. I think 127 is a good price for the cows. So I paid 635. Thirteen sixty eight and six thirty five is roughly two thousand. Let's see if we get our two thousand back. The meat, the hides. I would say we made a little bit of a profit there. We now break 5,000. Okay, we'll pick up in the next episode, probably looking for those looters. Thank you for watching.